Introduce you to Mr. Neville St. Clair of Lee in the county of Kent. Great heaven. It is true. And pray, what am I being charged with? Charged with making away with Mr. Neville St. Clair. Well, making away with myself? I've been in the force for 27 years. This takes the cake. But since it is obvious that no crime has been committed, I am illegally detained. My strength is as the strength of ten, because my heart is pure. <laughs> Alfred Lord Tennyson. <laughs> you lied to your wife, Mr. Sinclair. Is that purity? that I would have endured imprisonment, even execution, rather than reveal my miserable secret to my wife and children. All is now revealed, Mr. Sinclair. So be it. My father was a schoolmaster in Chesterfield. I received an excellent education, traveled, took to the stage, and finally became a reporter on a London newspaper. One day, my editor wished to have a series of articles upon begging in the metropolis, and I volunteered to supply them. So you became a beggar? Yes. And your experience as an actor must have proved invaluable. Yes. Exactly. Yes, I painted my face to make myself look as pitiable as possible. I manufactured frightening scar of a piece of flesh-colored plaster. And then with a dark wig and appropriate clothing, took my position in the busiest part of the metropolis. Ostensibly as a match seller, but yes, really as a beggar. And you did well? Yes. In one day I took 26 shillings and four pence. I wrote my articles for the newspaper, my editor was delighted, and I thought no more about it. Until one day, I backed a bill for a friend of mine, and had a writ served on me for 25 pounds. Well, I was at my wit's end, I mean, what could I do? And then suddenly an idea came to me. I asked for a fortnight's holiday from my employers, and spent the time in the city begging. In ten days I had the money and was able to pay back the debt. That was when I fell into the trap. How much were you earning from the newspaper at this time? Two pounds a week. Far less than begging. Yes. During the last few years I have earned on average at least 700 pounds a year. But that's a gentleman's income. 
Calm down.